हेलो एंड वेलकम टू क्या लग रहा है मार्केट और डेली प्रोग्राम ऑन निफ्टी बैंक निफ्टी एंड डॉलर स्लाइटली लेट स्टार्ट टुडे सो आई विल गिव यू द बैक स्टोरी माय मदर इज हैविंग अ नी रिप्लेसमेंट सर्जरी शी हैड द सर्जरी येस्टरडे सो ऑल वेल सो माय वाइफ एंड आई आर मोस्टली डूइंग हॉस्पिटल ड्यूटी सो आई जस्ट गॉट बैक होम एंड व्हिच इज व्हाई वी आर लेट बट नॉट सच अ नाइस डे टुडे फॉर मार्केट्स Uh, I think the last time we met, our verdict was to do call spreads for August end. Now the bad news, of course, is that they are in MTM. The good news is that the MTM is uh, uh, not very heavy, and you have like the entire month to do something about it, right? So, is something going to happen by the end of the month or not? Is a question, and we have the answer to that from this chart. This so. because there is a spot rolling over con- confusion and i'm not very confident about the futures chart which is there in trading view now i looked at spot right now you can see that there's a very clean channel emerging from the spot and i'm resorting to this channel also because from the price action today which happened at the bottom of the market uh, right so this bounce is coinciding sharp sharp bounce is coinciding with the bottom of this channel and i'm forced to conclude that there is a very strong resistance sorry support somewhere around 19400 right and you can also see that there has been a lot of consolidation at 19400 in the past so 19400 looks like a very strong chart support and also bottom of the channel right so let me write that down nifty 100 is a support and the bottom of a trending channel now most of the time when there's a channel in uh nifty uh, uh there will also be a channel in bank nifty and it looks like uh there is a channel here also right let me just define it a little better but the important point is that there is a rejection at the at this level again if you look at this right if you draw horizontal levels uh let me do it somewhere around here you can see that somewhere around this zone there are multiple times that nifty has bank nifty has gone and tested here so somewhere around this zone 44 700 types there is a support in bank nifty simply because there is a lot of channel here and today there was a strong rejection from the bottom right uh, dollar is the i mean i don't even know what to say right it's like i i strongly feel this is the technical analysis chart you are seeing here is a manifestation of the fight between bulls which i'm guessing is rbi and bears which is the rest of the world i know i've seen one fight between rbi and the rest of the world actually i'm not even sure if rbi was was to, because i mean from the currency devaluation indian industries and export has grained tremendously so i'd be very surprised if <clears throat> any con- exporting country in its right mind would want to make their currency stronger so i think rbi is uh, buying dollar probably i mean i don't know right that's all economic speak but we can see clearly from this chart that at least chalo somebody is buying dollar right we don't know who that somebody is okay we don't want to know who that somebody is right who, who cares who that somebody is but there is a strong you know bad i mean this is a proper war right this is like the army is here army is here now army advanced 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 there are skirmishes all over the place like this is like tremendous stuff happening here right um so that's dollar so dollar is so bank nifty also taking support at today's low dollar at the top of the triangular wedge <laughs> now option c 
rather open interest charts uh yeah i mean option chain same thing lot of calls added no surprises there lot of puts unwound also no surprises there this is an extremely call heavy option chain uh, pcr of 0.6 is also not very encouraging option chain is bearish as suggesting a neutral to weak expiry now this is a strong reason why i am not saying this is outright bearish because all these calls were added for tomorrow's one day right so for these calls to win it is just necessary that tomorrow's close happens anywhere in under 19600 so 19600 is so even if it tomorrow's flat day 19500 let's say 94 anything right nifty will uh nifty call sellers will make money 600 uh, saw a lot of unwind but that's not a surprising thing um there's a lot of um, unlikely to close above 19 90 to the pakka it's not right more aggressive view unlikely but why do you want to do more aggressive view like what's the point of that even what are you going to do tomorrow sell 19600 call it's not worth it right because at the bottom of the channel why do we have to do this circus um pcr 0 0.6 which is uh weak fia option data that should be very interesting today that is very interesting today because despite all the negativity in the market um uh, you can see that this call buying which has happened that's surprising it could be people unwinding the calls they have sold yesterday uh 93 puts bought this is negative so 30k calls bought 90k puts bought uh bearish this is bearish for sure uh 860 crores of futures data bearish and 19 1800 plus crore sold that's also bearish so what's the verdict um market looks weak from option chain and fia data <laughs> but chart suggesting bottom of channel if bottom holds expect a bounce else more weak i mean th that it is what it is right because if this level breaks i would not be surprised if nifty takes a further plunge maybe even to 18900 i mean let's not go so far let's take it one step at a time if this level breaks is definitely a shot right because uh, i mean there's no because right you can see from the cha channel why it is a shot the same applies to bank nifty although in bank nifty's case there are multiple uh supports here but still i would still might want to short it if it breaks but nifty is a cleaner shot than bank nifty if the channel breaks but don't jump into it at the first break of signal uh, you have to wait and see if it really breaks and holds or not dollar looks obviously bad I, I honestly i don't want to take a trade tomorrow simply because if you have your august call spreads which is bleeding negative mtm there's no need to do more circus we can just hold it um wait and watch price action at the bottom of the a the channel uh not trading till it is clear so So yeah, uh, this 
is uh, my view for uh, so this is my view for the for this expiry basically i i don't want to gamble because there are two conflicting signals the chart is saying something and then the uh, uh, data is saying something else in confusing times like that it is best not to trade of course if the chart had no support and it breaks with everything else breaking i would have definitely definitely shorted but i don't want to get into this thing right um, So this is our analysis for today. We'll see you again tomorrow. Thank you so much for joining. And as usual, till we meet again, please take care and keep your capital safe. Bye.